I'm really depressed at this moment in time. I've been sitting here for about 20 minutes just f***ing thinking about life with... Tumble out of bed, dizzy in the head, say what you say. Um, right, so, uh, last week was Mitch's first session, this initial appointment. Um, what we found was is that Mitch has a long-term uh, growing quadriceps strain, so we call it the flexor strain. So, for most people with this, you can get away with just resting it. With Mitch, he obviously does quite high impact, elite stuff, he around the world, trip around the world. Um, he's going to cause a lot of stress and strain to his groin. Now, what's actually happening as well is that, Mitch, I hope you don't mind me saying, but Mitch has gotten a little bit stressed about things with, um, I suppose, just anxious about being out injured for quite a while. So what's actually happened is, is that Mitch's rib cage has started to come up a little bit. So just an elevated rib cage. What happens then is that that throws all its core muscles out a little bit, which will then have a huge impact on his skin. And you making this documentary? I reckon there's a few reasons. Um, all of them involving uh, stuff that's happened to me. So, whether it be passing of uh, the family dog um, or, you know, stuff that might have been years ago. So, you know, relationships ending or, or you know, just seeing people improve and I'm not. But I reckon that's got a lot to do with it. Um, and I feel like people just need to know what it takes to be a freestyler, even though it might just seem that we just do football tricks for the football. <laughs> um, there's a lot more to it and it's very stress based and there's certain people that can do it and certain people that can't. Um, like it takes a certain type of person I think to do what we do. Like a lot of things can happen to someone and having something that takes uh, the stress away being removed from you. It can do a lot to a person, um, and I feel like it needs to be spoken about because people use freestyle as a coping mechanism, and when when you can't do the one thing that you love, it, it hurts. Do you think you'll feel a lot better after you've made this documentary and once you've got all of this sort of stuff off your chest? Uh, yeah, I would say um, I'd say that once I've got it all done, all the documentary and everything, then it's something that I've completed and something that I've stuck to, and it's. I reckon this is like my passion project, like my whole the past five years has led up to this and this moment. Everything that's inflexible and everything that's not ready and everything that's backwards and everything that's negative and everything that's condescending and everything that's carnal and everything that's holding me back, I refuse to take it over into another year and waste another new year with an old mind. The devil is a lie. I will rejoice. session yesterday I'm allowed three half an hour sessions a week uh, at the minute but I'm gonna slowly up it to 45 minutes uh, and then to an hour and an hour and a half which is what I usually train um, but I'm looking forward to it and it's a lot harder than I thought I can't do a thing um, get very sore very easily but like I said I've been off six months so what else can I expect uh, but yeah I'm looking forward to it
stuff like that can affect someone and um, seeing it all take place in front of you and you haven't got half of it but I suppose you can argue that you've got to look at what you do have um, you know find the good side of that but I'll be honest I'm struggling with, with that part of it because I, I can't see it and um, yeah hopefully it gets better Sure it will. But for now, for now, I don't know what's gonna happen. But yeah. Welcome to the second part of this film. Um one of the main reasons why I seem so unhappy in that clip. Although I didn't mention it, I hated the way I looked. Um and I always have felt insecure about my body, skinny, forever. But it was in terms of freestyle being somewhat in the way that I could not pursue how I wanted to look. So in order to make myself happy and to work on myself, 
I let Freestyle take a back seat and I made sure I became the person that I always wanted to be. And this is that second part of the film. Enjoy. <laughs> Yes. Hey. Success is coming in heavy, I think I'm changing already My life is intimidating, so friends just want to impress me Some were supreme to impress me, some bring a gun to impress me But none of that does impress me, wonder if it's love or envy Mark was trying to get me with M, I told him I wasn't ready Maybe that was a mistake, maybe I would have blown up already Wonder if Inniscope is mad that I didn't pick up when they called again Subliminal disses from legends are still compliments Torn money, have me talking shit Till I spent 60,000, I closed and went broke Manager screamed at me, watch your tone She won a couple thousand in the crowd Tell me yes, it's hard to tell me no I'm still in Germany with merch money in my lap, bitch I'm counting it even though I already double checked There's no better feeling than holding a parent's rent I know I can still fail, but they only see success